Good morning, everybody. Just want to give you an update on some of the things I've been working on on this uh, aquaponic system. Uh, one of the videos I told you, ultimately, I want to put freshwater prawns in the system to help clarify and all that kind of stuff. Um, and, and to raise prawns, you know, to, uh, it's why not use the prawns to help clean the system and in return, you know, eat the prawns, the freshwater prawns. So this is the, the first part of my uh, system that I've put together. A lot of people make these little, um, whatever you want to call them, um, prawn hotels, I guess. You know, they, they ultimately need um, places to live. So they, they have to have a lot of surface area. If not, they'll get overcrowded and, and start eating each other. So one of the solutions is to create something like this that has a webbing going back and forth to where they can have you know plenty of space to live in and this one here is just made out of PVC um, some weed eater line going across back and forth to create the the part that I pull the uh, netting across this is just um, just fish netting same stuff you'd have on like a like a fish net I just had a bunch of it uh, for some other projects that I was working on for some other things um, and that's it. You, it's what you kind of see. Now this fish tank here is kind of dirty. It's sitting out here and I've got to bring it in and, and put it to use too. But it just basically goes into the, um, the tank. If I can get it down in there. I got the, uh, the wire ties holding me up a little bit. I kind of built it just to barely fit in there. Uh, you can't really see because of the, the dirty tank. But, but there you go. It's... Um, it just allows you to to have the tank and have a lot of surface area uh, for the uh, freshwater prawns to to live and grow. And as they get bigger, you know, pull them out and put them in other tanks. And ultimately, back into the um, IBC totes, I'm probably going to stack up a bunch of these um, in that system. Maybe something a little bit bigger. I've got to see what the uh, measurements, um, you know, add up. You know, across the uh, IBC tote and how many of these I can put in there and and that kind of thing. So once I figure that out, you know, I, I may be able to put I don't know four or five or maybe six of these in an IBC tote and just stack them up and let them live inside the uh, IBC tote. So it so this becomes the clarifier slash breeding ground, not breeding ground, but growing ground for the uh, freshwater prawns. Well, that's it for now. Just wanted to give you a small update. Wanted to throw something out there. I've I've been you know, pretty busy, a lot of things going on. I've uh, got quite a bit of work done to my aquaponic system. It's springtime now, so I'm kind of moving outdoors. Um, going to do a lot outside too with the uh, aquaponic system, but like I said, I got a lot of work to do. But just wanted to show you this. This is a, um, a pretty neat way to help clarify your system. That's it for now, and we'll see you next one. Take care.